Hey guys, what's up? And welcome to part two of muscle soreness versus pain. We talked about why muscles muscle. Blah, blah, blah. We've talked about why pain disappears when we work out. Our brain is distracted, focusing on what we're doing right now. Hence, the pain goes away. You get warmed up a little bit. All right, I'm fine. As soon as you're done working out, the pain comes back again. What do I do? What can I do right now to make my life better? When we're working out, we tend to be laser focused on what we're doing. Proper form, proper muscle engagement, proper breathing, which is all great. You're squatting, you're making sure that your chest is high, your core is engaged, weight is on your heels. We come back home. We sit on the couch. We come back home and we work on the computer. We come back home, we watch TV, and an intense scene comes up. We clench our jaws. What's gonna happen? Or we play with our hair. I'm just going to play with it all day long. It's the perfect curl. Those little things all affect how you feel pain. Those little things all add up. Just as laser focused as you are at the gym, doing your workout, making sure you're engaging the proper muscles, you have proper form. Do the same thing at home. Whether it's proper posture, sitting down, brace your spine, keep your hips in, squeeze those glutes, and sit. Working on your laptop, shoulders up, as opposed to rounding forward. If you want to grab something from the ground, you're squatting down low to grab it, then come back up. Are you clenching your jaws? Keep your tongue at the roof of your mouth to kind of prevent you from clenching your jaws. Make sure that you're aware. Everything we do at the gym translates into everyday movements, everyday posture. Just as laser focused as you are in the gym doing your workout, be laser focused on your habits. Just because we're practicing proper form, doesn't necessarily mean we're engaging the right muscles. You need to understand what you're feeling when you're going down into a squat. A trainer might look at you and say, their squat form is amazing, they're sitting back into it, they're hinging their hips, but you're the only one who knows if you're feeling core engagement. You're the only one who knows if when you're pushing yourself back up from that squat, that your weight is on your heels. Same thing with running, same thing with walking. Is your pelvis in a top? Are your glutes tight? Is your core tight when you're walking, when you're standing? Are you ever letting everything loose? Proper form, it doesn't necessarily mean pain prevention. It's just not engaging the right muscle. Until you understand what kind of muscles to engage, that's when you're really going to succeed in your workouts. That's when you're really going to succeed in preventing pain, even when you're not in a gym setting at home. Everything we do at the gym is to enhance our lifestyle, right? And how can we enhance our lifestyle if we're only laser focused in one area, which is the gym? 